Hey, today I'm going to read one of the Pete the Cat stories out of this giant Pete the Cat book. Today I'm going to be reading Pete the Cat, Pete's Big Lunch. It is lunchtime and Pete is ready to eat. What should Pete eat? A sandwich might be nice. Yes, Pete wants a sandwich. Pete opens the fridge. He takes out a loaf of bread. He finds a yummy fish. He adds a tomato and mayo. Pete looks at his sandwich. Pretty good, he thinks, but something is missing. He wants to add something sweet. Hmm. Pete knows what he needs. An apple. Pete loves apples. I also love apples. Peach sandwich needs something else. Crackers. Every meal needs crackers. They are crunchy and delicious, Pete thinks. He uses a whole box. Pete looks at his sandwich again. It is still too small. Hmm. It's an interesting sandwich. I wonder how much food I need to eat, Pete thinks. My stomach feels very empty. Whoa. Pete adds a pickle, cheese, an egg, hot dogs, a banana, and a can of beans. Then to top it all off, Pete adds ice cream. He can't decide if he wants a scoop of chocolate, vanilla, or strawberry, so he balances all three on top of his sandwich. Pete looks at his sandwich. It is bigger than him. How will I ever eat that? Pete thinks Pete. I, maybe I need a ladder or a funnel or maybe something to squish it down so I can take a bite. That is a gigantic sandwich. I've got it, thinks Pete. He takes out his phone and calls his friend. He asks all of them to come over right away. Oh, I've never seen this character before. It's a dog. Everyone goes over to Pete's house. I hope they're hungry, thinks Pete. Hey, Pete, they say. Do you have any snacks? I sure do, he says. Come on in. He definitely has some snacks. Everyone takes a piece of the sandwich. There is plenty to go around. They each get a part of the they each get the part that they like best. Now there is no more giant sandwich. Sharing is cool, says Pete. That was pretty silly. The dog is eating a banana. Pete's eating the ice cream. Makes sense. Wow, well, there's the apple and the crackers and the fish and the beans. Fun. Thanks for reading this story with me. See you next time.